it's the 14th of April. We are ready to go to uh, Rico's auntie's memorial. It's a 40 day memorial. So that's what we're planning for this morning. So you've all seen this before when I do my mum's memorial. Well, in Cyprus it's slightly different because then they have like a, a get together at the relative's home. So this will be at her son's home. This will be at Rico's cousin's house. So that's our plan today. Yesterday I didn't vlog. It was a busy day yesterday. Basically we went to the graveyard. I cleaned my mum's and dad's grave. Give it a good old scrub that took a wee while. Um, what else did we do yesterday? And then by the time I mop and clean in here, um, that kind of took the best part of that day. And then we, we went, went the out. Yeah, then we went out last night, late last night, but it was seven o'clock, so it was dark here in the mountains. People on those roads, those roads, people. It was like like this. But it was like up in the mountains and then it's the restaurant sat down in a wee village. So you're going up in the mountains but the actual restaurant was in a wee village. One day I should take you my people. <laughs> we'll go ourselves because we know we, I don't get the camera out when, you know, it's, yeah. I was in last night. It was the food was really tradi traditional separate food. It was absolutely delicious. Anyway. So that's today's plan so far. Okay, my people. <laughs> we've uh, we've done the memorial. We've been for the coffee. We've chatted. We've caught up with Rico's cousins. We are now going to go and check out the Nicosia Mall. 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 We call it a shopping centre. It's a mall. Mall. It's a mall. It's American. Okay. Right. Here it's here. Minute, then it's there. So everybody's been going on about this place so we thought just before we go and get something to eat we're gonna go and check it out people. Graffiti here man. I don't think it's, graffiti it's graffiti terrible it's really in Cyprus. Bad. The graffiti in Cyprus is awful. So this is it here. Let's see what kind of shops there are in here. Absolutely roasting. Steve Rico said to me, do you want to go to the beach? But we've decided just to go to the... Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Mountains. For something to eat an early lunch today. Oh, there's an H&M. There's a Zara home. Allocated Mac store right opposite Beauty Line. <laughs> up there is looks like the food hall up the top there. KFC, Burger King, Pizza Hut. Swarovski, Mango Supermarket. Vans. Now on the second floor, it's not actually that big, really. So it's just really kind of high street stores. No Chanel, Gucci, or Louis Vuitton. We're on our way down. So they've all got tables inside. These other places have tables inside. Never tried a Taco Bell. Uh, Mexican man. Let's just get out of here. So Rico says we are in Gliru village. That's the winery we went to down there. We stopped down there. There are some vines at the side of the hill there. Or some of their vines. This is we were dining. Fanaria Diz Maruluz. Place here. In there somewhere. Very busy, so all the cars parked all the way down. So we are in people, this is what it looks like inside. Traditional whole onion, whole lemon served at the table. Beer, 
water. <laughs> food has arrived. We have gleftigo, we have salad, we have tahini, we have chicken souvla. Trico's already getting stuck into a nice cold cup for the beer, the wine, and we have. Yes, Well, thank you. That was somebody selling asparagus um, at the table. So we have lamb souvla. We have potatoes. What is it? To the UK, UK digging into that basket of asparagus. There we go. That's it. There. Good morning, welcome to Monday. We're back in the car. We are now going to the uh, appointment we have made to uh, transfer all my deeds with my new ID number. Did I say that correctly, Rico? <laughs> I'm amazed. <laughs> so that's what we're doing. So, deeds in hand. That's what we're going to do. And the reason we're doing that is to make life a lot easier when we want to get things done over here because anytime I need to do something I need deeds and yeah that's cutting a long story short <laughs> that's what we're doing this morning that's one of the jobs then we're gonna go and argue a point we've already written to them from Scotland and we're gonna argue the point that they came onto the land cleared the land without our permission uh, basically cut through the watering system the hoses so there was hoses all over the land which watered the olive trees and fruit trees and whatever and they're all kind of sitting in a pile now and what else have we got to do pay the sewage yeah. which we don't no, have no, no no not the sewage the it's just the, the rates for the land the rates for the land that's all we've got to do today okay people <laughs> does not get easy anyway so we've been where I said we were going. Now, what they've created is they've created an email. They've created my... What have they done, Nico? They've sent an email from that department to you, right? So that you so can basically go I'm just... go I'm basically I'm going on the system. I don't, anyway, it's, I'm just doing what they're telling me what to do, people. So they've, they've taken an email, they've attached it to my name and whatever. We're, we're basically creating an account. We're now going to this post office that they've sent us to to get my signature certified. Oh, people, honestly, honestly. <laughs> and then we're coming back here once my signature has been certified and then I can be entered officially into the system with my new ID well with my ID that I created last year okay people that's step number two done so my ID number has been entered into this system which is called Ariadne Ariagni. 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 This is the system that they, they, they all use over here. So that's. I've now been entered into this system officially. So we should be able to get things done now. Oof. Let's see what the. Where they're going to send us next. Land Registry of Nicosia. That was the building we were given the forms. And just across the road here in this little building, this is where all the work's getting done. This is what this is a place they're telling us where to go and what to do. And this lady in there is very helpful. There we go. Okay. We've gone as far as we can go for today with the deeds. So now I can't think. So now what? I'm going to piece. No, what, what, what's what's what they're doing with the deeds now? They've got them on the computer in this system. They've opened that system. You're registered in Ariadne, whatever it's called. Right. Now they're going to send them into the... Into this... Land Registry Department to issue a new new document with, for the land uh, in Stravolos and put your, your, your ID on all of them. But the new document for the land of Rock was an up-to-date valuation and everything so you can go to the water board. We'll probably have to go back again. 
if uh, in three months' time, I don't know, they might ask for another new one. But you now, are kidding me on. But now you're on any acne, you can request it yourself. All okay. Right. So now we're going to go and pay the rates and dispute the sewage bill, basically. Back in the car. <laughs> Other two, you probably haven't left the car. So we are now. Where was that place where we just left? The townhouse type thing. <laughs> so we've left the. Let's call it a town hall, right? And uh, we're now having to go to the electricity board to get a, a copy of all the electricity bills since 2021 to prove that nobody's living in the house on a daily. So we can get the amount reduced for the rubbish uplift. For the rubbish uplift. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, we are home, having a bit of lunch. I just broke my fast with a coffee and a wee pot of yogurt. Got the washing out, got the glare. Just sit and do a bit of editing whilst looking out. Can we see? Too glary. Anyway, it's a beautiful day out there. I was gonna call it the jungle, but it's not a jungle anymore. It's an olive grove now. <laughs> there we go. So we came home and Rico's kind of now arranged for the last few bills that we've been running around to pay that we can pay them online. Most of our bills we pay online now so we can pay them from the UK. So it was just the um, rates for the land here, the house here and the, I keep calling it the sewage but it's not the sewage, it's the rubbish. Yeah. It's not called rubbish, so what's a nicer word for it? Trash. <laughs> Honestly, it's not trash. Anyway, batteries flashing. I haven't said that for a while. It's been lasting a lot. I can't even speak to people. Honestly, I'm exhausted. Anyway, now the big decision of the day is where do we go and eat? Do we go to the beach? Really, we don't, we're all meted out. We don't fancy meat. What's that, Rico? It keeps... What did you say, sweetheart? Everything out. We're everything out. But it's been, it's been like initially it's all oh, yummy, it's shifted, yeah, it's kebabs, it's wow, 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 and then by the end of it you're like, take me home, give me a salad, and all of that, because I, I kind of just I'm not a fan of salads in all these places. I want my own salad. Because shaking his head, as he does. Anyway. So the dispute about the them clearing the land, that the council clearing the land, um, they couldn't well, really no further forward. Although they said we don't have to pay the bill at the moment, we have to go back home, try and find the email. Rico kind of looked through his emails on his phone, but he's going to check properly on his computer and see if we can find the original email we sent to them and then he's going to forward it to this particular person rather than to a place. We now have a person and see what they say so we're not paying that one anyway <sighs> people <laughs> starting to get that hot way isn't it rico last night was a bit a bit hot and yes, we got cut off there i was saying um last night was starting to get that hot way not hot enough for air conditioning but the problem is I, my pyjamas that I bought are all kind of the pyjamas, long sleeved, long legged pyjamas. You need short pyjamas in this weather. I was lucky because Kelly left me a pair of her strappy ones but they're still kind of long legged. Uh, and I, I, I can't sleep, I need to wear pyjamas to sleep, I can't sleep in my birthday suit. So yeah, I think to come to Cyprus the weather is very changeable you need to take you need to bring like a denim jacket with you for this type of weather you need maybe one sweatshirt as an option i think linen trousers that kind of thing would be ideal i've worn all, I've, I've worn everything that i brought with me actually so you need your shorts you need a mix so not wintery stuff spring stuff 
with a few summer things, I think, is what you need. <laughs> I feel as if I'm dead flat when I'm speaking. I decided to come to Lanaka for something to eat. So we're trying to decide on a new place or go back to the kind of second beach club that we've been to. So that was called Rebuke, Rebuke, yep. Rebuke, yep. which we thoroughly enjoyed. Just having a wee drive through first before we uh, decide. It's a seafront just there. <gasps> Honestly, the drivers over here, they're the, oh. go through these side streets by the harbour so we're kind of thinking of dining in that place there oh some nice fresh air what so this is the menu here, which is not very appealing. There's no description. Fish maize per person, minimum two people. A variety of salads, dips, and eight different kinds of fish. In the car, so we've decided to go to what we know because these places are all kind of fried fish, just fried, 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 fried. Nice bread to taste. You can butter me a wee bit of butter when I come back. So Rico has a salmon with a pad choy. I have, what have I got? Remind me Rico. Sea bass for lads. Did I say sea bass for yours or salmon? I can't remember. Salmon's mine salmon. and yours is sea bass for the butter broccoli. And the other bits and pieces. If you get, uh, if you get it from the other side you can really see it. By the way, turn the plate round. See the lad. Oh, I fancy you yours more. Do you want to take it now? Some chips because ordered a wee beer and with the beer came this little tub of cocktail nuts very nice and I love that they're packaged because if anybody had a nut allergy our Anna it's not a problem very impressed with the toilets people nice thanks Absolutely delicious and now just to top it off we're gonna have one of these ladies fingers full of nuts things I don't normally eat but when in Cyprus So good. Mm. Rico has been threatening to take a different route for the last two weeks that we've been here. Tonight he has decided he's going to try this new route. Is that right, Rico? No. <laughs> Are you going to? You're gonna coward out of it again? Yeah. No, you're not. Yes, I am. So is it down there? Go, 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 go. Is it? I don't know. I don't think so. It's the next one to come. Oh, you chickened out again. Oh. <laughs> Let's see. So normally, know, wait a minute. Normally we go down that way, and every time we've passed here, they'll say, "I'm sure this way's a quicker way." No, no, what, what I'm saying, it might avoid that roundabout. Right, okay, and let's see. second thoughts, I don't think it will, because I think it just brings you round to the lights after we get off. 
but we'll soon find out. The okay. supermarket here has been closed for years and years and years, so apparently the owner of this supermarket not just got, got done, well, whatever he had, got done for tuck, for tax, tax avoidance, for tax fraud, so he's been in prison. Anyway, the road seems quite clear. Yeah, it's very quiet tonight. It's a Monday night. Good morning, my people. Welcome to the 16th of April. We are back down in Nicosia just to uh, buy a few things, pick up a few souvenir type things and yeah, I'm actually looking for a kind of backgammon, not a kind of backgammon set, but a traditional backgammon set. A picture of Cyprus one, sorry. <laughs> for, for Luke. Sorry. Is what I'm looking for, my people. I think I'm going to end up in Metro or the other one, Jumbo, to pick one up. So that's what we're doing down here. Um, so last night we had a bit of a get together, some relatives came round to say hello, goodbye. <laughs> I don't know why you we're say expect, goodbye, I we're, expect, hello. we're expecting some tonight as well. The hey -ho. We managed to get um, the backgammon and things like that, but the, we have a bigger problem on our hands. Um, the person that's doing everything, the changing of the deeds and all that, has encountered a problem. So, we have been summoned to his office to try a different way. Nothing's ever easy, is it, people? And the problem is we don't have time. This is Cyprus. <laughs> this immaculate building here is the Archigo, Archi, see what we call? Archibiscopi. Archibiscopi, which is basically the um, the centre of all churches, the, the yeah. base, yes. the base. Head office. Head yeah, head office is the word. Look, we were commenting on how well kept everything is here. Most well kept because of all the embassies. Anyway, we're on our way home now, people. Can't even remember now when I left you. I can't remember, but what is our last vlog? We've been. Oh, I went back, I signed, we went home. We put out the washing and then we came back down to Nicosia to grab something quickly to eat before we have visitors again. Oh, and people, the heat today is getting to that point where it's a wee bit unbearable. This is my auntie Yanulla at the... Nabonduta Kaisha? She's chosen one for me. There we go. Uh, here we go. Catharisto. <laughs> She says this is a she says this is a sweet one. Okay my people we are starting to get organized to go. This is the uh, backgammon I picked up for our Luke Mario. This is a new machine for Rico's barbecue souvla. And right here we have homegrown olive oil. So that's basically the olive oil that my uh, auntie has been gathering. We've just had visitors leaving. So I'm trying to get organized now. Um, so yeah, that was the olive oil. My auntie was gathering between her olives and my olives. So she gave me some. So I am going to take it with me to Scotland. Oh, mess, I know, I know. I'm tired now and oh, I need to get stuck in. <laughs> <laughs> 